federal unemployment benefit programs end next weekend. The Virginia Employment Commission has until Labor Day to comply with the judge's order, fixing problems and clearing most of its unemployment claim backlog. Investigative reporter Evan Watson explains why this combination means some claimants are worried about getting left behind. Dozens of unemployed workers tell me their unemployment claims are still flagged for review, but with major deadlines approaching, they're getting even more concerned. Ashley Strickland's unemployment benefits stopped coming in March. Her claim was one of many in Virginia flagged for potential fraud, and she spent months talking to Virginia Employment Commission agents and verifying her identity. Like, look, I'm a mom of two. I have a two-year-old. I have a six-year-old. I'm homeschooling. It's been literally about to be five or six months, and, you know, but it's the hold up. The same thing happened to Renee Hairston in March. Her personal information on her claim was changed without her knowledge to an Indianapolis address. She spent months working to get her payments back. I have to wait for someone else to investigate the matter, even though I've done the ID me verification, even though I've sent in my ID social security card address, light bill. It leaves us asking the question, okay, if they don't believe you, What's next? The additional federal unemployment benefit programs end on September 4th. The VEC says if a claimant is found to be eligible after that date, they'll get back pay. You hear a lot of people just don't want to work. That's not the case. I keep a journal of job searches that we're, we're required to do every week. Strickland is hopeful, but says staying patient is difficult after five months of waiting. You can't really do anything other than have patience. Hopefully, I would get it. Um, like I said, I don't want to think about the negative and say, oh my God, uh, no, I don't want to think about that. Regular state unemployment benefits will continue after September 4th. In Hampton, Evan Watson reporting for 13 News Now. Nationally, new unemployment claims rose slightly last week. In Virginia, initial weekly claims dropped to 12,700, which is still about four times higher than the pre-pandemic weekly average.